probably the first snowmobiles. Hi, YouTube. We're on our way to get some gas, and then we're gonna head to, um, I think it's called Saratoga Park, but it's Saratoga Auto Museum is where we're going. <coughs> so, sit back, hope you enjoy it, and we'll see what happens. I'm meeting, um, <coughs> probably, my oldest friend, uh, met him in second grade when I was in grade school, and about once a year or maybe twice a year, we get together. You can see the snow on the sides of the road. It's all gone down by me. This is uh, 13 South. We're going for 13 North. Turn left on Storm. Avenue of the Pines. Not Avenue of the Pines on the left. On the left, that's the uh, museum. We'll ride you right into there. That's just the way. Oh, I think I went the wrong way. No, I didn't. It says, okay. It's all about arriving at 110 Avenue of the Pines on the left. And there's the museum. Used to be a bottling plant, they tell me. Model T. Oh, look at this. I'll take some pictures of that. Model T. Um, what do they call them? Model T Snowmobile Club. Oh, we have to have some pictures of that. Uh, these are presented by the uh, Model T Snowmobile Club, and they have a website, modeltsnowmobileclub.com, if you want to know more. Um, that's who showed these vehicles. Really cool. They're a kit that was added to the Model T, and I believe these kits were uh, out of a New Hampshire company. I may have to redo everything. I don't think this thing was videotaping. <laughs> 1932 MG J2. This uh, 35 Riley Imp CMV 91. This here is a um, 29 Bugatti Type 37A. And over there, Good year. yeah, over here is a Austin Mini Mook. Mini Mook. This one here, look at that baby, that is pretty. That is pretty. That's a 48 MGTC. I guess this video is going to be for. Guys down the, end, the other end of the. On the Rain Drive had a MGTC, yeah. And one guy had a, uh, a, I don't know if it was the same bunch or not, but remember they had an El Dorado? Yeah, with a um, funky fins. 51 50. All R J2 and an HR 50 HR 1500. I don't know, cars of, I don't even know. A bunch know. of good cars down that end of the road. That guy this had, is. Um, <laughs> this is a 1923 Ford Model TT, one ton truck. I'm assuming it's in the process. Oh, it's like a part. Yeah. Uh, oops, I'm sorry, buddy. It's good to see you, Bob. That's my buddy, Bob. That's what this is all about. <laughs> Model T restoration, that's what it is. It is, whatever. That's what that is. 
That's what that is. That's a 1925 Model TT popcorn truck. Wagon. Fresh buttered popcorn. Pretty soon they'll be outlawing popcorn. The vehicle, this vehicle was built to the specification of the late Albert Rich of Cambridge, New York. 1925. Was, was, we, Lou and I saw it when it was on the road there. Yeah, did you buy popcorn? Yeah. We That'd be, buy it. That, would, <laughs> that would be a better story. I know. I bought popcorn from that wagon. Did you? Yeah. No, I didn't. I'm saying it would be but a better story. But I saw it selling popcorn. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's what 1913 I'm. Ford Model T. There you go. Can you imagine being out riding around that today? Freeze your ass. Oops, excuse me. Not that supposed to use those know. terrible words. I always like that. Rebuilding a racer. That's what that one is. And the uh, little one is pretty cool. I'll have to call you to find out which ones are red. 59 Stan Gulini. Am I saying that right? Whatever it is, it's Stangolini. cool. Stan That's uh, Stan Gallini. That's <laughs> yeah, kind of 1960 Lotus. Now I've watched those race. Very nice, 1960 Lotus. Okay, Casino de Monte Carlo. Let's see what this bit. This is a 62 Sunbeam Rapier. They also made great electric rays. <laughs> I'm not sure it's the same. It was his daily drive out of Sunbeam Alpine. Yeah, 59 Boontz Buck Special. I'm going to walk in your way here. Then we got one of these. Now that's cool. I'd like to drive around town in that. 1964. Elva Mark 7S chassis 7060. A two liter four cylinder BMW power plant. That's the first one I've been able to find the fat power plant. We got, what is this thing? Lotus. Lotus. 57 Lotus 11, classic 246. Let's see if we can, 125 horsepower, 1,040, 60 cc engine that produces 125 horses. How many horsepower? Yes, we had some people in school have alpha. This is uh, 58 Alfa Romeo. Got it. Gilani T Sprint Velocity. Very nice. Power varies from 50 to 100 horsepower found on lightweight Gilani. Whatever. Wash, and that's what it was it. That's what that car was. I was talking about the um, car with the Cadillac engine back when we were kids. It was an Alpha, two seat Alpha Romeo, fifty six Porsche three fifty six coupe. Very nice. Yep. Next one. Guy who owns, is an Aston the guy Martin. used to own a hardware store where we are. He moved to, he owns one South Coast yeah. He's got a Morgan. Oh, green, all green. They're still making them, right, Morgans? I think, that, I think they might be. Are. Hand, hand, uh, they have wooden frames. wood frames and no, all that rubbish that. in them. Which, you know, it's good I don't know if you can, I don't know if you can sell it in America, though. Because we got too many rules. 1958 Morgan Plus Four. Uh, all three models are still available, but using different engines. A plus eight with a, the Rover V8 was introduced in '68. It's a lot of power. Put a V8 in it in '68. Yeah, they did put a they put a Rover V8 in it. Yeah. It's a '58. Very nice. Very nice. 
But they close us off from that other. Yes. Yeah. This art in 1966 Ampica model 770. No, I don't think it was. I think it was downstairs, wasn't it? Yes. They did. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Very nice. And then they're all busy with kids with school and blah, 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 blah. But they don't seem that much in the winter. Nope. So anyway, we're going to do a little video here just to call this thing out. This is my buddy Bob. Bob and I have been friends since I got left back in the second grade. Okay. You, were the, you were the first guy that I met in second a grade, grade behind where I was. Second grade is what we, we met. I know. We went down to visit me, yeah. And, yeah. Uh, me and Margie or somebody yeah. came down and... My mom came looking for us. <laughs> your well, mom nonchalantly one. said we were playing in the woods. <laughs> we got in a lot of trouble together. We did. Yeah. We as did. friends a long time ago. It was yeah, a good friendship. Been, I, I say you know, that we've been friends since second grade. A, a lot of people say I don't remember anybody <laughs> from back then. Right. I did. Um, I told you that Barbara Blatz is. Yeah, uh, yeah, you did. I talked to her on Facebook yeah, again. That's cool. Which is unbelievable. So you you're probably the two now? oldest. Huh? Are you photographing us now? Yes, we are. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, I won't so say yeah. anything rotten. You can say anything <laughs> you want. Anyway. I can edit. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, I wanted them to meet my, my 400 subscribers who never watch my videos. It's all, oh, there you it's go. an odd setup, YouTube. I was on, uh, but, um, I'm reading a uh, book about Charlie Chaplin. Yeah. By a psychologist, psychiatrist wrote it. Oh, yeah. First, he said Chaplin. He's mostly, yeah, Chaplin and his was mother not a and father person. up for the first half of the book. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. But I went on uh, YouTube to see some of his old movies. I like YouTube. I like it. Let's cut this off so we can go back to a normal conversation. There we go. How are we? Okay, we switched vehicles. We're in my buddy Bob's new. Okay, you got to tell me. Oh, you know how to get there. Is that you? Okay. I think so. Okay. Of course, you took me away from my GPS, which I, go, go I need a GPS to go around the block. <laughs> Barbecue for lunch. It's gonna do a pulled pork. See, I think that's what I'm gonna go for. The last I got was Pulled pork. Looking good. Okay, we're back. Back in our own truck. My buddy Bob is on his way home. It was a good visit. And we're headed out of um, Saratoga State Park here, if that's what it is. I guess it is. So this is probably the best place to end the video. Is right here.